welcome to Chevening Scholarship Information Session. My name is Roger Sotom. I'm currently a scholar studying innovation and entrepreneurship at the University of Warwick. This is video number one in a series of videos that I'll be doing in a couple of weeks. And I want to welcome you into today's session. Now the import of words cannot be overemphasized. With words, we curse. With words, we bless. The difference is word choice. I can tell you something and it can be bad or good. The only thing that makes a word bad or good, whatever separates the two, is word choice. Word choice. So, word choice is very important when you are writing chevening essays. Now, for you to answer essay questions correctly, you also have to have a meaning, clear meaning or a clear understanding of what different words means. Now, in this particular video, I'm going to talk about leadership and I want us to unpack what leadership means. I've been reviewing some essays, have reviewed about 20 essays. The mistake I see people do in the essay, one mistake, I will have another video where we list common mistakes I've seen, but one mistake I see, people confuse the word leadership with the word management. Okay, so I want us to unpack what leadership means. Now, leadership is made up of two words, leader and then ship. Okay, leader is derived from the root word leodan. And leodan means to cause to go with oneself or to bring a person or an animal to a place. It can also mean to guide with reference, to act on, to bring by persuasion, to induce to do something. So I want you to carefully mark the words that I have mentioned. Persuasion, induce, to guide. Those are very, very important words that can then be attributed to, your, to, to, to leadership. So when you're writing essays, does your essay show that you have induced something? You know, one day I was talking to my friend and he was telling me how some people, they complain so much, yet they are doing so little. You have never planted a tree, but then you want to be called a leader. You have never influenced somebody to go to school or to do better. So I want you to be very keen when it comes to the words guide, persuade, and induce, okay? Now, the second part of the word leadership is ship. So ship, as a suffix, is used to show quality, an act, power, office, condition, or position, and it's usually added to nouns, okay? So when we say relationship, it's a condition where nouns come together. Now, it will be very important to understand leadership philosophies. Just do a basic Googling and understand different leadership philosophies because that will help you to understand how to write the introduction part of your essays. Understand leadership philosophies. So let's talk about the difference between leadership and management. So management means to maintain something. You see, like a caretaker, you maintain, you plan, okay? You organize, you staff, you direct, you control. That's why we have project management. That's what project managers do, okay? Leadership, on the other hand, means to model. Have you modeled something? Have you inspired something? Have you created a vision? Have you challenged the status quo or common processes? Have you enabled others to act, encouraged the heart of someone? Those are the qualities I want to see in your essay. All chivening will be intending to see in your essay. 
please remember these are my views and does not in any way reflect the views of Chivining or Foreign Commonwealth Development Office. These are my own view. So if you are a Kenyan, I would want you to refer to gubernatorial debate, Nairobi gubernatorial debate 2017, I suppose. It was between Miguna Miguna, Evans Kidero, Peter Kenneth, and Governor Sonko. So one of the things Miguna said, I will quote verbatim, Nairobi needs a leader. Nairobi doesn't require a manager. I will, re I will hire managers. So there's a difference between management and leadership. So you may have written a very beautiful piece of essay, but you have just listed things that manager would do. You have just listed how you have maintained relationships, how you have maintained good records, how you have organized, directed, how you staff people under you. But that's not what Chivening is looking for. Chivening is looking for initiatives that show that you inspire vision for the future. And one thing we should not miss in your essay is your ability to influence others. Ability to influence others. Now, we are coming to a different part, writing leadership essay. Now, when you want to write leadership essay, please remember the basics. Use the STAR approach. Give a situation, okay? Then say the task. Say the actions you did. And what were some of the results? Okay, so that is the STAR approach. And many times I don't see star approach in people's essays. And it, it annoys, it annoys. Okay. Now, as you use the star approach to answer your achieving essays, please remember that the star approach should just help you to answer these four W questions and how. What, when, where, why, and how. Now, another common mistake I've seen people do, you just start your leadership, you say with, in 2015, I was like this, this, this. In 2017, I was like this, this. No, 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 no. Any piece of literature must have three parts. It must have an ad or an introduction, a body, and a conclusion, be it a song, be it a poem. It must have an introduction, it must have a climax, and then an, a, a conclusion. Ensure that you have an introduction, a body where you put like three paragraphs of the situation you are in. Let's say in 2015, I was, uh, let's say, student leader, and my task was to do one, two, three, four. These are the things that I did, and these were the results, and this is what I learned from that. Okay, so that's what you need to do when writing your leadership essay. Now, this was just to tell you about leadership, the meaning of the word leadership. Okay, so we'll get deep into these essays if I find time and I will try to burn midnight oil to create videos that will help you with that. I have done a video on chivening secret, the chivening secret. So watch it here on Bafunde YouTube channel. It's so simple. You just have to study. You just have to study. So remember, you can reach out to me through Twitter, LinkedIn, or Instagram. Remember to like and subscribe. Thank you.